If you have read the story, The Little Prince, perhaps you will remember the chapter when he meets the fox. And he wants to play with the fox, but the fox tells him that he is not tame. And being from another planet, he was not familiar with the difference between wild and tame. And so he asks the fox to tell him what that means. And he says to be tamed means to build connections, to make ties, to be bound to one another. And so he establishes the pattern through which they will get to know each other and become familiar with one another each day, sitting quietly and then a little closer until the trust is built. And until the fox sees the wheat in the field, which has no meaning for him because he does not eat bread, but associating it with the color of the little prince's hair, he finds joy. And then tamed, it becomes hard to part. But the time comes. And so we read, So the little prince tamed the fox. And when the hour of his departure drew near, Ah, said the fox, I shall cry. It is your own fault, said the little prince. I never wished you any sort of harm, but you wanted me to tame you. Yes, that is so, said the fox. But now you are going to cry, said the little prince. Yes, that is so, said the fox. Then it has done you no good at all. It has done me good, said the fox, because of the color of the wheat fields. The fox goes on to tell the little prince that he has a secret to share with him as he leaves. And here is the secret, a very simple secret. It is only with the heart that one can see rightly. What is essential is invisible to the eye. That is why those who mourn are blessed. Because there is truth in that poetic line, better to have loved and lost than never to have loved at all. To have been tamed, to have created ties that hurt when they break, but leave you with happy memories, which allow you to see a color or hear a song or have whatever memory triggered that brings you joy. That is the blessing that can be found Good morning.